you've done. Your greatest pride, a blazing ruin. The screaming, the suffering, it is all because of you. Perhaps I am at fault, but my true mistake was in not seeing you for the cruel and treacherous barbarian that you are. Cruelty is in the eye of the beholder, wouldn't you agree? Cruelty is the refuge of the weak. You know nothing, old man. It is your weakness that sets your legacy ablaze. Legacy? It could have been our legacy. Your gifts are many, but I blame only myself for ignoring your faults, my son. You are not my father! <sighs> you have but one heir, Lord Noguchi. And when I find him, I will end him. Good pup. You're a good pup. Yes, you are. Oh, <laughs> oh you scamp. <sighs> that is not a puppy. Now, don't let its appearance fool you. This Kukajin is still a pup. Aren't you, you little? You darn old golden, you stupid old chopsticks. I'll break them into two to see how you fight them more than you smelly nigga. Hey, what's that now? It's been three days already, and you haven't even let me draw my sword. What I need is your training. Not a job washing your under things. What if I told you that you've already begun your training? That all these chores have been a clever lesson in disguise, eh? Wait, really? No, not at all. It's just hard to find good help out here. <laughs> You crazy old noodle head! <sighs> if you don't want to teach me, maybe I can learn the old fashioned way. Interesting idea. Fine, we'll fight tomorrow. After you clean up this mess. Oh, I know what it is. You're too scared to fight me. Oh, <laughs> is that so? Yeah, yeah, without those chopsticks, you couldn't even defeat a puppy. <laughs> An actual puppy! You can't beat me, Samurai. Come, sit and eat. You'll need your strength if we're to begin training tomorrow. I'd rather eat tanuki poop than have another bite of that disgusting filth you call food. Okay, you win. We will have one lesson today. This is a baseball.
That's why we clean. Have you stopped to wonder why I begged you for that bell? It's priceless. Money's not really my cup of soba. The reason is that the moment I heard it ring, I knew without a doubt that I needed it. <sighs> then why did you give it back? It served its purpose in my hands, and I had a feeling that you would need it next. Samurai, though these are humble accommodations for a prince. Sorry. Excuse me. Well, look what we have here. The last Noguchi standing. It must be my lucky day. <laughs> oh, don't be afraid. Little Prince. This will be all over soon. I'm kind of a big deal, if you weren't aware. Easily the best bounty hunter alive. They call me the Mark. Do you know why? Because I always hit mine. <laughs> Never heard of you. It's nothing personal, of course. Being the best means I have a reputation to uphold. Can't let a wee spud such as yourself slip through my hands. Gotta protect my good name and all that. But 
your name? <laughs> well, it ain't no picnic being in the Gucci these days now, is it? Tell me, little prince, were you there when your daddy died? Or did you run like a coward before the battle was over? <laughs> You talk too much. We are honored, brave samurai, that you passed through our humble village. You're... You're the son of Lord Noguchi. Doesn't look like a prince to me. It is him. Oh, blessed day! The lost prince has returned. I'm not who you think I am. <laughs> nah, doesn't smell like a prince either. The bandits that attacked our village, they will return again. I'm sorry. I can't help you. Please, wait! Please, Lord Noguchi. We need you! Father. Do you remember this place? It was snowing then as it is now, deep in the heart of Yakushima Forest. You were only eight years old, armed with a bow nearly as tall as you were. <laughs> Your mother said it would get caught up in the branches, but you insisted on joining me anyhow. We found the enemy of our clan nursing a broken leg at the riverbank, sure to perish if left without care. While I spoke with the man, you found a traveling merchant nearby, but he refused to help. So what did you do? I told him our family names. I said that we would be camping near the river for two days. Why? Because the clan would send a soldier to get us, but find only the injured man who would be saved. You see, our family name can be used for much good in this world. <sighs> but this is different. And so are you. You have grown and you needn't fight alone trust your heart son you already have everything you need father wait Now give us what we want, or I'll have your beak for a, uh, for a... For a chalice. Yeah, for what she said. Leave him alone. Aw, oh, look at the little hero. I love heroes. They go great with potatoes and gravy. Let him go. I, I'm warning you. Yeah, and what if I don't? <laughs> if you don't, then you'll have to deal with me. Uh, you heard the boy. Drop him. <laughs> Any more requests? One more. Leave this place and never return. We're not going anywhere. At least until we decide to go somewhere, and then we will. But not because you told us to. <laughs> Who is 
this guy? My name is Noguchi Michio. That's the kid from the poster. Dead or alive, that one's easy. Let's not mince any more words. I'd much rather mince some grits! <laughs> Like a boar? There will be nothing boring about it. What the? We're not done with you yet. Come on and fight us. We have lots of potatoes and gravy, and we love fresh man. You have honored us again, my lord. Today, you honor me. Thank you. Walk out of here while you still can. Return to your master and tell them. These lands are under the protection of Clan Noguchi. There is word of a skirmish in the Kappa village. And what is it to me? Someone defeated the bandits harassing the people. Their spirits are lifted. They're having a feast in his honor. They will break like the rest when we arrive. But the one they're praising, he's a boy. No more than 16. They say a bell hangs from his belt and call him Noguchi. Looks like we'd better make sure he doesn't do anything stupid. Eh? Mm.